。下日子别平安，今天是国家初二，国家运头一个主日，感谢主，和咱伫 Internet 内面各一摆三度。最近我听到有种日子，被专家都对着这个新冠肺炎 （COVID-19）， 叫除了叫上帝医治以外，叫做咱伫苦难中间有通更加明白咱的上帝。英国一个真出出名的派命的大哥叫 Winston Churchill， 讲了一句话 ：“Don't waste any crisis， 唔通浪费任何的危机。伫患难中间，唔通问上帝为甚物，都问上帝，你是一罪 ，Who are you？” 因为各户人国家有机会，各亲临不上帝，在困难中间，互相都互咱一个真真好嘅答案，好慢啊，别把咱嘅心，上家来敬拜属王咱嘅上帝。诗篇二十七篇第一节：耶和华是我的亮光，是我的拯救，我也惊神啊呢。耶和华是我性命的保障，我也惊神啊呢。第四节：有一件代志，我不求耶和华，我也要祈求，就是一生一世。住伫耶和华的殿中，瞻仰伊的荣美，伫伊的殿内。
叫梦。
ในจิเบเปงานนั้นสกัดเนี่ยปีบานนั้นในซีมเนี่ยสู่ช่วยเปียกับช่วยปุยเช้าแต่อันซิงเก่งวีที่ก็ลำตัวเฉินสู้แต
献给主，全给主使用。主啊，主啊，我感谢你，我要感谢你。Let's get in here. So, two a beer, cup two a beer. I take the bread and the cup together. Let's have a cup. Do you get a cup of tea? Tea bag, we thank you. You listen to us. Just the two sisters, two years old, so hot. 为君的罪，定在十字架里面，将你的身躯劈开，主将我宝血流出，来洗净君的罪，医治君一切的亏欠，好君在最上帝你的家里，今日你有通领受你的饼，立你的杯，和你的生命提起咱已经在那的里面，不落讲现在挖掉，不再是挂。乃是基督在我内面的活着，何君因为主的生命的原因，何君一生为主来活，特别君感谢你。这个今日在你的头前，你也是饼和杯下的姊妹，管君每一个人，君的身躯、君的灵、君的魂，拢都蒙主的家己的保守，完全无通指责。直到主耶稣第二摆对天顶过来，管上帝祝福你，施恩福你。祈祷洪哥，主耶稣基督的圣名，阿门。愿上帝祝福你和你姊妹，阿门。和你姊妹平安。Peace, brothers and sisters。咱继续思想地位人生的蓝图，这个系列的信息。Let's continue our message series, Blueprints for a Life of Wisdom。今日来看地位人生的观察，透这个 message 无奈。Today our title is Observations for a Wisdom-filled Life。The first message, helplessness. Then the game which turned us to the siege. Our passage can be found in Ecclesiastes chapter four. Then, don't gun. You can join by more than parents among us. Then I will check it. Get get that issue. If you have more than one child, then the size is the size. Two, three, or four. You take a high, high, high in charge. You will realize something. Most of the kids are quite different. Each child's observation skills are different. I just like to cook, 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 cook. Some children just eat and sleep. But some children are very curious about the world. But some children are very curious about the world. Yeah, my children are very curious about the world. With big eyes, they observe everything around them. Then they grow up. And after they grow up, yeah, observation skills are better than others. Some children see things that others don't see. 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 Some children see things that And in chapter four, it records all of his observations. See, just the first one. In verse one, it says, "No, but again, again I looked." The first, just the first one. In verse four, and I saw. I saw. The second one. In verse seven. No, but again, again I saw. The first one, just the first one. In verse fifteen. I saw. Solomon, every time, every time, one time, every time, one time, I saw. King Solomon again and again he pondered and he observed. He saw the same. What did he see? He saw the society situation. He saw four observations. He saw four observations. He saw the oppressor and the oppressed. 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 He saw the
现实社会的现象。And these are phenomenons in society. 就咱在一一项真重要嘅代志。It makes us understand one thing. 人嘅理想及社会现实，实在有一个叫做 distance 嘅距离。There's a gap between human ideals and social reality. 用一个汉文嚟解释，就叫做无奈。Using a Chinese word to describe it, it is helplessness. 人生真无奈。Life is very helpless. 唔是每一项代志都照咱安排发生。Not everything will follow according to our plans. So, we don't just be a perfectionist. Therefore, do not be perfectionist. Look at life at a different angle. Let's look at the Look at life at a different angle. Let's look at the first one. 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 Let's look at the 夸受皮的人落目屎，无人安慰；皮伊的有势力，也无人安慰因。安尼安尼，我赞叹一个早已经死的死人，也皆用恶毒的恶人。Again, I looked and saw all the oppression that was taking place under the sun. I saw the tears of the oppressed, and they have no comforter. Power was on the side of their oppressors, and they have no comforter. And I declared that the dead who had already died are happier than the living who are still alive. In verse three, 并且我拿着未出世的，就是唔不过到立功之下的派大志的，比这人看人更加强。But better than both is the one who has never been born, who has not seen the evil that is done under the sun. Solomon 讲到这个情况 ，King Solomon saw a situation. 这款无官无势的人 ，those who had power. 滥赏用伊个官兵 ，carelessly use their power， 骗人、抢占人个便宜 ，they would abuse and oppress others。有官那是好诶 ，having power is good。但咧有人滥赏用官兵个时阵 ，but if you carelessly use it， 得个开始多来恁个败坏 ，it will lead into corruption。所以绝对个官力只有多来绝对个败坏 ，absolute power corrupts absolutely。你讲之下无什么新个代志 ，there's nothing new under the sun。过去几千年是安尼，现在也是安尼。What has been done in the past will be here tomorrow. 无论是国家，无论是家庭，无论是教会，无论是你个公司。Whether it's a church, a country, a nation, or even a family, company, and a company, 情况都是相反。All the situations will be the same. 绝对嘅官兵，即系都系绝对嘅败坏。Those who have absolute power will be corrupted. 所以，大家任何嘅所在都需要嗰个 balance of power， 即系势力需要平均。Therefore, in every place, there must be a balance of power. 我这个邓家文，我我邓家文，我这个问题。A coworker once asked me. 你讲当接受个木的团队三个最强的时阵。When a deacon and a pastor works together. 三个被最头啊。Who shall be the head? 我讲的原则的里面。I said in principle. 所有的代志和团队牧师给负责。In spiritual matters, the pastor should lead. 那行政的工作应该由接受给负责。But in administrative matters, the deacon should lead. 但第一点我是配搭。But what's more important is cooperation. They must work as a team. Encouraging and reminding one another. This is accountability. Everyone must have an accountability partner. But Solomon's observation did not stop there. He continued to observe. Then he saw a different situation. Those who are oppressed would have tears. No one is there to、uh, to comfort them. Perhaps they are afraid of being involved. But maybe they're just indifferent. Because people tend to just care for themselves. But King Solomon said, "Those who those who oppress them have power." But nobody also comforts them. So the result is the same. So they're in the same situation. People, the oppressed, the oppressed, are in difficulty. The oppressed and the oppressed 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 are in Jacob deceived his father and his brother. But the 上帝安排一个叫做拉班的 father-in-law 去骗伊。And God placed Laban, his father-in-law, to deceive him. So, 鬼债人和各个鬼债人去骗。The bad people are oppressed by even worse people. 啊，是无人去安慰伊。And no one is there to comfort them. So, 大家人拢在受欺压的里面。So everybody is in difficulty. So Solomon 讲 ，So King Solomon said， 哎，安尼
Those who have died have it better. Because they cannot be oppressed any longer. And it is even better for those who have not been born. Because they have not experienced this difficulty. What is King Solomon trying to say? He said, Life lived without God ends in extreme helplessness. Whether you're the oppressor or the oppressed. The second observation. You saw the competitive man and the lazy man. Let's look at the verses 4 to 6. And I saw that all the toil and all achievements spring from one person's envy of another. This too is meaningless, a chasing after the wind. Fools fold their hands and ruin themselves. Verse 6. Better is one handful with tranquility than two handfuls with toil and chasing after the wind. In verse 4, Solomon says, And I saw. Telling us this is another observation. Solomon saw that there's two types of people. One, a hardworking people. Who likes to compete with others. Will not accept defeat. There's a famous song in Taiwan that says, Success comes with hard work. There are some people who work very seriously. They're not afraid of they're not afraid of busyness. And they're very competent. They're very skillful. So Often they are more successful. But what is the result of their success? to be one To be envied. Is there something like this in this world? We can see this everywhere. In the nation, in the church, we can see this. There's a very famous story in the Bible. It is King David and King Saul. It's a story of jealousy. At the beginning, Saul loved David. Because David played the harp for him. David was the one who slew Goliath. But when David became more and more successful, Saul was unhappy. One day after a victory, David came home. The women were singing, Saul has killed his thousands, David his ten thousands. At a time, Saul was overcome by his jealousy. He decided to kill David. And Solomon said, And I saw that all the toil and all the achievements spring from one person's envy of another. This too is meaningless, a chasing after the wind. You will not get commended for your success. You will just be envied. What's the use? King Solomon saw another person. Verse 5. Fools who fold their hands and ruin themselves. Who is this? Lazy people. They do not want to do anything. They do not want to work. You want to do it? You go do it. I will go and sleep. They would fold their hands and ruin themselves. What does this mean? A Chinese saying says, staying idle and not pursuing decent work. Solomon saw two kinds of people. A hardworking man. Not afraid of work. And he has success. But he is just envied, criticized. 
。第二款的人 ，a second type of person， 什么都不被做 ，lazy， 就是困 ，he just sleeps， 吃 ，he just eats， 看 TV，watch TV， 踢球 game，play games， 一单无成就 ，he is not successful， 但系结论都是相反 ，but Solomon has a conclusion， 你讲第六只。如果摸了摸了一把，得闲安静强路；摸了两把，劳碌力荒。Better is one handful with tranquility than two handfuls with toil and chasing after the wind. 保罗，这个所罗门这个结论是什么意思呢 ？What does this conclusion mean? 你讲这个人啊，一生 a person， 摸有一把 ，if he gets a handful， 得闲安静 ，and there's tranquility。你讲你用用这个手去掠物件 ，he's saying that you have one handful and you get things。得到这个物件，好享受你手的物件。And after achieving this thing, enjoy it. 当然无下水啦。Of course, it's not a lot. 因为一个手可以两个。Because it's just one handful. 但但是也无很辛苦。But it's not too exhausting. 也真简单。It's a lot simpler. 够有时间当享受你的物件。And there's time to enjoy it. 伊讲，我的电脑里两个手可以两。Rather than having two handfuls. 两条牙锥。Getting a lot. 但是付出的时间、精神也是也多。But you also spend a lot of time and energy。结果无通享受。You don't have time to enjoy it。结果是劣荒人。And you're just getting wind。用咱国家容易明白嘅 explanation。Using a better explanation。你一日最近十六点钟。Let's say you work sixteen hours a day。哇，当然伫金子咯、物质嘅层面咯，得到真多。In terms of money and material things, you have a lot。但请你记得。But please remember。得到也多，失去也是也多。If you get a lot, you will have to give up a lot。个人失去你嘅健康 ，perhaps you sacrifice your health。个人失去甲你嘅出来人嘅关系 ，your relationships with your family。包括甲你嘅丈夫、你嘅太太、你嘅囝儿 ，with your wife、with your children、with your parents、with your family。因为根本你无时间甲你做一个个 ，because you have no more time to spend with them。另外，当你老有成就嘅时阵 ，and you become more accomplished， 可能弯刀批评攻击 ，you will be envied, attacked, and criticized。再是拿拿拿出来 ，and you will have more and more of these things。所以所罗门爱讲什么 ？So what is Solomon saying？ 人需要学习嗰只 balance， 平均啊，平衡啊。He said man has to have balance。温困最近，哎呀，享受工作嘅劳苦。Work hard， but also learn how to rest。就天做上帝 ，just like God， 创造这个世界。He made the world， 用六日创造。With six days, 隔一日佢就安息日 ，and he had one day for rest, that's called the Sabbath. 六日做工，一日休息 ，six days work, one day rest. 所以享受你嘅工作嘅果效 ，to enjoy the work that you have made. 今次国家有智慧 ，isn't this much wiser? 主耶稣不讲一句话 ，Lord Jesus once said. 人啊，叹到全世界背照家己嘅生命，用什么嚟话生命呢 ？What good will be someone To gain the whole world, yet forfeit his soul, or what can anyone give in exchange for his soul? Solomon, the conclusion is what? What is King Solomon's conclusion? No, in the life, life is very miserable. Life lived without God ends in extreme helplessness. Whether you're a successful, you're a competitive man or a lazy man. 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 You're a 过多的劳碌者。This is the lonely worker. 第七九第十二节。Verses seven to twelve. 那那些来过第七九第八节。Let's look, first look at seven and eight. 我转眼看到你讲之后，有种空空苦的代志，有一个人过多无力、无家、无兄，竟然劳碌无停止，目睭也无以坚持为够也。伊讲我劳碌、劳劳碌碌，吃苦家己，无不享福。到底是为为啥眼呢？为积罪呢？这是互相是激动的劳苦。Again, I saw something meaningless under the sun. There was a man all alone. He had neither son nor brother. There was no end to his toil. Yet his eyes were not content with his wealth. For whom am I toiling? He asked. And why am I depriving myself of enjoyment? This too is meaningless. A miserable business. Solomon 有另外一个观察。King Solomon has another observation。你讲到什么呢 ？What did he see？ 你讲一个过度啊劳碌嘅人。He saw a lonely worker。Solomon 用四款嘅诶诶嚟四个情况嚟 describe 这个人。King Solomon had four descriptions。头一项。The first。你讲这个人是过度无力。He said this man was all alone。可能是因为工作嘅原因。Maybe because of his work。即系无为佢做工。He was very busy。为金钱为嘢事业。For money, for his needs, he 无无无
无太太，无仔女。He ended up not having a partner and children. 甚至无兄弟，无姊妹，无朋友。He has no brothers, no sisters, no friends. 只是家己一个人。He was just a lonely person. 第二呢？第三，这个人劳碌无停止。He worked endlessly. 无停的追赶。Constant work. 呃 ，workaholic. He was a workaholic. 只爱研究，无停止作息。He always researches and works. 无放假。He has no breaks. 啊是无当享受工作的诶果效。He never enjoyed the fruits of his labor. 第三个情况呢 ？The third description. 无以金子为羔羊。He is never content with his wealth. 因为无停的追赶。Because of non-stop working. 我相信这人已经真有钱了咯。I believe he is already very wealthy. 但是总感觉无够。But he doesn't think it's enough. 继续无停的去追赶。He keeps on working. 第四啊，第四诶诶 ，describe the fourth description。唔知一位神阿无为。He does not know for whom he is toiling for。伊问下佮一个问题。He asked himself。我安心嗰是为神阿艰苦啊。Who am I working so hard for？ 因为我是孤单无力嘅人啊。I am a lonely person。所以这个人唔知为神阿艰苦，为神阿无为啊。He doesn't know who is working for, who is being busy for。意思讲，这个人根本唔知啊，人生嘅意义喺度咯。He is saying that he does not know the meaning of life。第九到第十二节。In verses nine to twelve。是所罗门观察这个孤独嘅工作者，又对咱提出一个真重要嘅叫做 warning， 而且叫做 reminder。It's a warning or a reminder that King Solomon is giving after the, these observations。九七 ，verse nine。你讲啊，哎呀，两个人总比一个好啊，因为两个人嘅劳碌，杀到啲度美好嘅果效。Two are better than one because they have good return for their labor。两个人总比一个好。Two are better than one。这个两个人可能是指夫妇。These two may refer to couples。但是不一定是夫妇。But not only couples。你嘅重点是你俾到所有一个同伴。What's important is you have a companion。所以呢，我我我我。我我能够能 friendship， 还是叫做 fellowship？ Could be friendship or some fellowship。地上咧创造这个世界时阵 ，When God created the world， 上咧特地讲 good 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 very good very good。God said good good and very good。但是头一摆讲 not good。But the first time he said not good。什么 not good？ What was not good？ It's not good for the man to be alone。It's not good for man to be alone。这个人家己跳无好啊。It's not good for man to be alone。人未做过度去生活。He cannot live alone。人嘅皮头需要。He must have a companion. 我讲讲这个当婆，哎，就得是你的丈夫、你的太太、你的 spouse. Again, this companion may be your spouse. 但你的当婆，哎，就讲是你的朋友。But also can be a friend. 你也需要找一个朋友。You must look for a companion. 找一个 companion 来帮衬你。Have a companion to help you. 第十到第十二节。In verses ten and twelve. 所罗门教导咱爱找一个当婆，有三好的当婆，有三真重要的条件。King Solomon says a companion has three good characteristics. Number one. The first. 这个人需要跟你同行。He's a peer who walks with you. 你讲第十节。Let's look at verse ten. 那是博多，这个人同扶起伊个同伴。那是孤单，家己博多无人，无别人扶起来。哎，这个人就有灾难咯。If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. But pity anyone who falls down and has no one to help him up. 这个好嘅同伴 ，a good companion， 是一个人，是爱一个人，甲你同行嘅人。It's a person who walks alongside with you。因为当你跌倒嘅时阵 ，because when you fall， 伊坐喺你嘅背头 ，he is by your side， 伊有当将你扶起来 ，he can lift you up。阿先帝阿摩斯讲咗一句话 ，Prophet Amos said this， 唔系同心，唔就同行。Do two walk together unless they have agreed to do so？ 爱同行，大家需要同心。They must first be in agreement。你你需要找一个甲你同心嘅人。You must find someone who is in agreement with you。同心，因为你嚟叫做 values， 你嚟价值需要上。If you have unity of heart, then you will have the same values。价值观那无上是永远未可能同行。If your values are different, then you cannot walk alongside each other。早晚都分开。Later on, you will part ways。第二。The second。好嘅同伴需要同你同。同在。A good companion is someone by your side。你讲第十二节。Let's look at verse eleven。佢讲两个人三个困，两都乱火，一个人家己困就烧呢。Also, if two lie down together, they will keep each other warm. But how can one keep warm alone? 两个人三个困，那谁烧得 ？Husband and wife。When two people sleep together, we think husband and wife. Yes， 但是可能是别的关系。Yes, but it also could, could also be different. This is the main point. Two people sleep together to keep each other warm. This point is that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you. This is the point that there is someone there beside you.
，全家是困一条床。Oh, the entire family would sleep in one bed。个下家嗰只起炉。And there's a stove underneath。所以全家都烧。So that the entire family is warm。即系先嘅好卵仔，一个战场啊，仗战场啊，大战。This verse is showing something important。即系亲密嘅同伴，常常追住你。A close companion would stay close with each other。你知最近因为即个 Covid nineteen 嘅原因。Because of Covid， 你已经一年冇面对面杀毒咯。We have to see each other face to face。虽然咱哋即个叫做网络 internet 里面聚会。Yes， we do have fellowship on the internet。但是冇够。But it's not enough。好嘅朋友，那是你领嚟面出住你一啲 physical 面对面出住你。A good friend is not only with us in spirit but also physically。三家可以饮一杯咖啡，比你 internet 一点钱更加好。It's much better to spend a cup of coffee with each other than and some time on the internet。但系你嚟注意哦。But please notice。唔是特你沙都都是好朋友哦。You don't have to meet every day to be good friends。好朋友或者个尊重要条件。A good friend has a good has a requirement。你个。箴言十七十七招。In Proverbs seventeen seventeen， 朋友乃是上亲爱，兄弟为患难而死。A friend loves at all times, and a brother is born for a time of adversity。这条圣经是一个 parallel 的圣圣经。This is a parallel。朋友就是兄弟，兄弟就是朋友。A friend is a brother, and a brother is a friend。好嘅朋友亲像兄弟，上上亲爱，为患难而出世。A, a true friend is like a brother born in a time of adversity. The 困难的中间不会放下你，这是你的好朋友。In times of trouble, he will not let you go. 第三条件 ，the third requirement， 好嘅朋友需要一个好嘅搭档。A good friend is a colleague who works with you. 你讲你就比较。Let's look at verse twelve. 有人功成过多，一个人有两个人便也得得同意。有三股合成的说，无容易接档。Though one may be overpowered, two can defend themselves. A cord of three strands is not quickly broken. You just hear singing with one, two, three, boy. This verse has one, two, and three. This guy, man, two men can be overpowered. One can be overpowered. That guy, man, two men can be overpowered. Two can defend themselves over an enemy. Three men can be overpowered. Two can defend themselves over an enemy. And three can overcome this enemy. This is a very important meaning here. There's very important meaning here. 那需要同心合意。We must all come together。应该就 all for one。It's all for one。力量是非常的大。And their strength is overwhelming。这个这个好难猜呀。This tells us。好的同伴还是好的同工。A good companion is a good co-worker。用现在话叫做团队 teamwork。Today's term teamwork。那所罗门观察世界，我看到两个叫劳碌的过多的人。Solomon observed that there's a man who works alone. He's very poor. He's very pitiful. Because he has no companion. Because he has no companion. He has money. He has money. But he's not content with his wealth. He's not content with his wealth. But he's not content with his wealth. Because he has no one beside him. Just, 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 just 钱都无咯，只有存钱啦，钱啦，钱啦。He has nothing but money。所以我们来讲什么呢 ？What is Solomon trying to say？ 无钱嘅人生是非常嘅无奈啊。Life without God is extremely helpless。包括一关真孤单、劳碌工作嘅人。Even especially for this lonely worker。第四个观察。The fourth, fourth observation。有关系富强者。The powerful but vain man。十三九十六七 ，found in verses thirteen to sixteen。你讲贫穷有智慧的少年人，也过礼貌，无要听人讲话的戆人，戆戆。这个人对家中间出来最戆，在你的国中间本来是双向的。Better a poor but wise youth than an old but foolish king who no longer knows how to heed the warning. The youth may have come from prison to the kingship, or may he may have been born in poverty within his kingdom. 我喺度你讲之啊，一切所行动嘅人，诶，活人，拢滚得第二个，就是起来代替流亡嘅少年人。伊所治理嘅正人，就是伊嘅百姓，真生真正无生未来。第二，第二后来嘅人，尚且无看伊，只是富康，就是劣康。I saw that all who lived and walked under the sun followed the youth, the king's successor. There was no end to all the people who were before them. But those who came later were not pleased with the successor. This too is meaningless. A chasing after the wind. These four verses tell us again with two different people. The first is a poor but a wise man. 
The second is an old king who does not heed the warning. Now, this poor and young wise man. Now, now this poor and young wise man. He did prison and went out. He came out of prison. But because of his wisdom, his knowledge, many followed him. Later on, he replaced this old king. And under his rule, the population increased. So this man was very talented. So many people supported him as king. However, a new generation rose up. They were unhappy with him. Perhaps another young wise man came up. Then he replaced that guy as king. What is Solomon trying to say? He observed something important. All power and authority is meaningless. Let's say you are king today. In those days, kings had absolute authority. He will, everything will happen what you want. Yet, when a generation comes, a new generation comes and passes away, today you have absolute authority, but someday someone will rise up and replace you. And this person who replaces you, he too will be replaced by another person. No one will hold on to power forever. No matter how talented he is, there's a good example in the Bible, Genesis, in the story of Joseph. Joseph with his wisdom and knowledge saved Egypt. In the seven-year famine, Egypt did not perish. But it actually increased in strength. All the other countries came for food in Egypt. So Joseph Joseph was a savior of Egypt. However, we can see in Exodus, first chapter, a new king rose up who did not know Joseph. Not long after Joseph died, not long after, a king rose up who did not know him. Church, you see? However, we're not kings, but the principle is the same. All authority on earth is temporary. If you're not there, people will forget you soon after. I always tell the church leaders, Never build a memorial for our pastors. No need for the first senior pastor, the second senior pastor. Mm. You can mention them in the church's anniversary. But there's no need to build anything. There's no value in this. Please remember, there's no president who has no criticism. There's no no doctor who gets talked about. There's no lady who is disliked by others. And there's no pastor who is not backstabbed. Mm. These are the realities of life. If your heart believes that there's no God, you'll be very dis disheartened. I work so hard, but you treat me like this. What is Solomon trying to say? Life lived without God ends in extreme helplessness. Whether you're a young wise man or a foolish old king, King Solomon had these four observations. These are the different situations of the world. Now there's a gap between human ideals and social reality. So Therefore, so we will feel that it's all meaningless. However, if we have God, our our meaningless can turn it to satisfaction. 
turn to fullness. Oh, emptiness will turn into fullness. No, no, mo, hulai e penjo is jin sun yi. And their helplessness will turn into satisfaction. Hey, then as ni lin sang u shong te ma. More importantly, is your life, do you have God in your life? Ni jan ni lin sang la u shong te. If your life has God, ni do shong te ya di de ge jo chon hong wo ya bo ho ka pang chan. You will receive his all around protection and help. Ji ji shi pen ji ba yi ja bi pi ya jin ni. This is the truth that can be found in Psalm 121. It has some 121 too, but that is thinking. There's only eight verses in that chapter. But the word help appears two times and protection six times. Each verse talks about his help and his protection. The psalmist says, I will lift up my eyes to the mountain. Our, our help comes from above. The psalmist says, Your foot will not slip. The protection comes from beneath. The psalmist says, The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The protection is at both sides. The psalmist says, The Lord will watch over your coming and your going. The Lord will protect you in front of you and in behind you. The psalmist says, Today and until forevermore. This is unceasing protection. This is his complete all around protection and help. Life can feel meaningless because we do not have God. But when our lives have God, God will protect you and help you in every way. May God bless you. May you have this all around protection and help. May you have this all around protection and help. Let's pray. Dear God, come share it. Solomon,来观察，我觉得这个世界有真正困难的情况发生，人总无得到真正的满足，人也无上帝，无论咱有什么都没满足。我觉得这世间的现象的时阵，我亲亲在一起很大事。人生若无上帝，实在非常的无